I was just going with it, brother. I said target target lot. Target target lot. <laughs> I said target. Okay. Alfonso, this is Optimus Prime. Transform and roll out. We gotta fix that, and that's why we're here. What's up, Alfonso Nation? Alfonso Peterman, welcome, one and all, to another episode of Teletran Toy Hunts. Look, look what we got. Look what we got. This is here. Are, are we back in motion? We're back. Guys, first of all, happy holidays. We've officially entered the season. The air is nice and crispy. Feeling good. Not cold enough for a jacket yet, but I got jackets on deck for that. We're at Walmart. We might go to like Target and maybe the toy room, depending on the time to see what we got for the upcoming holiday season stock. I don't really know what to expect, but I feel like we're gonna get into some good stuff. So by all means, let's roll into the store and get it done, baby. Woo! It's beginning to look a lot like Leo. Everyone, what's happening? Oh my God, we're gonna die. We're gonna actually die right now. We shouldn't die. You're gonna totally hit me and it's not okay. It's fake news, folks, fake. That's not the enter here. Try again. So, uh, not exactly sure what to expect. We did come here before. I think I came here in the last one and it was very surprising. A lot of new stuff. So this is gonna be kind of like our checkup to see what did they follow it up with. So let's go ahead and roll in and do that. Yeah, no, oh, I saw Richard Madden and I just immediately like a magnet. Just like a magnet. Just, I need you to pull my hand off because just... I'm magnetically connected to. There you go. <laughs> I could have played it off and just. <laughs> All right, we're here. Wow, okay. So, actually, a lot of great stuff. Just like last time, we have the Studio Series Sideswipe. This is the Babers Sideswipe. This is the one that I first found. Uh, along with Jolt. There's Jolt right there. And you've got Studio Series Cup next to him, looking nice. Uh, we got B127. There is only one way to end this war. You know the rest? No. You? So first you say Quintessa. I'm not over that. <laughs> um, blur on the stir with... in the middle of the cat's purr. Oh. In the middle of your... Murder. There you go. Murder. murder. No, mur murder. Mother. Murder? No. Yeah. yeah. No, you have to just make up words. That's yep. we do it. Basically. Hey, so this is something new. Uh, we got Shadow Panther, which is looks like a Cheetor redone thing that Hasbro yep. does quite mm -hmm. all the time. Mm -hmm. But not actually... This actually kind of looks cool. I do like Cheetor. The actual, like... I like the actual mode of the figure. I actually like how it is. Autobot tracks on the backs oh. of the stacks oh. of flattened sacks. Yeah. I like him. If I, you see, if I, if, if I would just continue to collect this scale, this would matter to me, but I don't. Over there, if you look up there, you got blur, cup, blur and cup, blur cup. We can make a word. Blur. Club burp. Club burp on the twerk. Don't be a jerk, all right. And <laughs> get to work. Get, hey, all right now. Coronation Star Stream. This is bad comedy. Pretty nice, good stuff. Got the sound wave there. Um, man, I was excited when I first saw him. When he first came out, we unboxed him and then I just don't like the, the QC of red at all. <laughs> Even the RC. Don't like the QC of RC very much at all. But, um, and they also have the, the Beast Wars things that they're doing. With, like, you know, they're making those again. 
Sure. To each his own. Yeah. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it. But in hindsight... I mean, it's it's a decent section. Good. It's a decent little section they got. It looks good, though. It looks good. I mean, this is... Like I said before, this is the kind of store that would literally only have red. They wouldn't really have, like, all of the other Studio Series, so... Good to see a good selection, even if I'm not, like, getting any of them. But... Pretty much it. Oh, oh, oh. Waspinator and Nator. I'm, I'm not a voice actor, so that was probably a tragedy I just did. And I apologize. That's I forgive my you. Official statement. I forgive you. We gotta do Marvel Legends because Marvel Legends is also iconic. Because Marvel is also iconic. So take a look at. Okay, so yeah, this place barely actually carries Marvel Legends. Which is a tra like a national emergency. Like, what's happening? First of all, you have a lot of everything else and not Marvel Legends. Right. So I don't understand Literally. if they like know what people are looking for or like what people are after. Because all of this, all of this has been here. So they know that nobody's buying it. <laughs> so why not make some corrections? They just don't do that. So no more Marvel Legends from what I've seen. But this was the place I, I found this, the Spider-Man. From No Way Home, the movie coming out December. Sick, sick. I think it's still December. I hope they didn't push it back. They always they're pushing back every. They freaking push back Multiverse of Madness. Are you? Do you know what that is? Mm -hmm. Excellent stuff. Mm -hmm. It's decent for this store because I know that. I just know. I know that this store is not really fond of getting great things all the time. We're entering the holiday season, so that's something that is subject to change, and there's going to be more stuff coming. We just got to stay vigilant, as hunters do. So, I think we actually have time for the toy room, possibly. Oh? I'll see if he is, like, prepared. He has a lot of stuff. Um, So, I'll see. We might get the toy room, and then go to Target. Okay. Target. Okay. And, uh... Let's get after it. Let's go. Ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna go to the toy room because the toy room is so terrific. It's so great. Sir. And the pile on Sir. is so amazing. Excuse Sir. me. American Carnage. American thing. Carnage. I need you to do one thing. We're gonna go to the toy store and, and we're gonna buy a lot of toys. I need you because to do believe one me, thing. toys are <laughs> the way she's looking at me. How are you, man? Oh, she waves, she waves back. <laughs> she's like, how are you, man? She's like, she's like, you thank you too. <laughs> I hate us. Can I see you the way I breed you in? I can't play the music because of copywriting because of YouTube. YouTube is going to do it in COPPA uh -huh. and the demonetization and the ending of all creators and YouTube in the world. Uh -huh. But yep. we're at the toy room. We are mentally disturbed in it. Yeah. I, I, yeah. What is it? Did we, did we do anything special? I think it's just been a while. Yeah. It's been a while. And you guys have been like, is Leo dead? Because Leo's I, not dead. Because Leo I think he's right dead. Here. I he's think he's dead. dead. He needs to see Starstream, and he's not dead. Let's just come on. <laughs> the, the longer we sit together, the more mayhem we produce. Toy run, baby. Her let go. Oh my God. Dude. Legion. So they good to be to, here. They come to summon my legion. <laughs> you know, you can show them the uh, plethora, the armada oh. of things that's there. Dude, there are. <laughs> Look at all that. There's so many new things. Lots of great stuff, though. There's a lot of loose figures, and this is still like a lot of fragments of what that one guy sold to the toy room to basically get uh, the Galactus. A lot of that stuff is still here. I'm seeing some new faces, like this right here, I don't know what this is, but these two guys are new. Um, not really exactly sure, but looks good. Heck yeah. I kind of, you know, I'm kind of digging it. I'm kind of digging the whole layout. Marvel Legends section, beautifully Yitch. and wonderfully made. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and I'm a fan of it. We've got Baron Zemo here. This is from the Disney Plus. Uh, Falcon and Winter Soldier uh, wave. That's pretty nice. Tons of the wings. I wish he would just sell the wings separate. You know, they would just sell the wings separate and not do this build a figure thing after. But build a figure is pretty sick, though. It is, but when it's wings, 
is right. just wings. Yeah. Like, you know, it's cool when you build, a, like, an actual character to have an extra thing, but you're building an accessory. Right. That's, like, Loki. my favorite MCU villain for obvious reasons. Yeah. Nobody else can do this. Captain America himself. I can't wait for Captain America 4, the movie, you know, right up here. Um, <laughs> Captain America 4 is going to be coming out. It's going to be Sam Wilson, thankfully, so I can breathe when I'm watching the movie. For once. Actually focus and breathe. For once. So it's great to see Sam Wilson and somebody else <laughs> taking over the world. Guess who's sitting on the throne? Look at that. Way at the top. The person who ought to be on the throne. There you go. Your mom. We do have Rhett Gar, which is new to this place. Rhett Gar, looking fantastic. C'est très bon. Je t'aime Rhett Gar. Je pas collecté Rhett Gar. Pas non plus. Mais il y a beaucoup de, de choses ici. Que il y a des personnes qui veulent acheter les choses comme ça. Et ça, c'est très bon. Oui. All right. Anyway. Great stuff. I don't know why. I just kicked into French mode. Oh, what they've got. A lot of studio series. They've got a good collection of Bayverse and G1, which is always great. Um, and then you've got things like this, you know, the Phantom Strike. Is that Phantom Strike? Yeah. So that's fun. And then you've got Thrust on the Trust. Oh. In the middle of a bust. A bust. But don't ever trust a big gust oh <laughs> i love it when it's an actual word and we didn't have to make up a word you know uh optimus prime look at sublime all the time i know how to rhyme like and, optimus prime yeah and that's pretty much i mean I'm you guys have it. seen most you guys have seen most of this stuff um in the previous one a lot of the stock is the same except there's a couple of differences i actually like top homeboy right here Core class, if you're into that, which I kind of am. I have Optimus Prime only for the collection, though. Starscream is there. He used, he had Soundwave. Yeah, he is. He had Soundwave. Of course. Of course. Absolutely. He had Soundwave. <laughs> but they don't last at all. Does whatever. Iron Man, Man does. He's Spider Iron. Iron, Iron Spider. Spider. There it is. Iron Spider. <laughs> like it. I like it. Iron Spider. Great. Front and center. Iron Spider preparing for the Delta variant. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you got it. Ninja. Iron Spider preparing for COVID-19. Wear a mask. Look at this. <laughs> There's... Hey! Venom. So that's, that's... Listen. First of all, I don't know how he has a lot of these. Because um, people are raving after... Am I correct? Raving after Venom. So come get Venom. Because he's here, and he won't he's be here for long. Right, right Run into the hand ninja and a lot of other stuff. So you're doing great. You're doing <laughs> All right, more, more Marvel more. Legends. Let's Goodness. go. Marvel I, Legends is actually I don't know why killing I've, it today. I've, I've really been like admiring those. I guess because I've been collecting Transformers like all my life. They're just killing it recently. And it's just cool to have something different that I'm collecting. Oh. Oh, Surtur. Do you have, Leo, if you don't get this right, we're not friends. I'm just going to make a public declaration. Do you know where this is from? Yes. What movie is this from, Leo? <laughs> oh, you suck. <laughs> okay, what did he actually do? Uh, uh, he was fighting uh, Thor. He was fighting Thor? Him and multiple others. Mm-hmm. What was his job, Leo? No clue. Uh-huh. I knew it. I knew it was a, I knew the fakery was buried in this. <laughs> that what are you here? That Thanos, who is absolutely powerful by all means necessary. Is that it? Yeah, that's yeah. the classic Thanos. Um, with the Infinity Gauntlet, one snap, and your mom is gone. I almost dropped the phone just to do it, just so it could be like <laughs> a snap. <laughs> More stuff at the bottom. <laughs> Including Quicksilver, which is uh, a figure that I don't see very often at other stores here. Uh, Quicksilver for Age of Ultron. Almost said Extinction, because that's usually what I say Age for. Uh -huh. But <laughs> we got the Ultron pieces, that's super cool, and you've got the figure. Uh, so that's nice. Honestly, it would cop 
I wasn't like specifically going for in-game. But this is great. This is absolutely great. So I'll just let them see the rest. I don't, I'm not gonna narrate because <laughs> I'm not a Ninja Turtle, I'm not a Power Rangers, I'm not a... That's a little time is cool. Can we make our own pops? Go ahead, do your pop thing. That'd be, dude. Oh, let's make, let's our, make own our own pops. pops. Like a Alfonso Leo, like a Teletran. Dude, I, but I want the number series. seven. This is number eight. I want seven. You want seven? Yeah. I, well, what if I want seven? Well, you can have nine or <laughs> three. <laughs> I want seven. By the way, I have a lot of people asking me if they can come here. And the answer is a resounding yes. He's encouraging people to come here. So I will put the address in the description box for those who want to visit. Is that acceptable by way of the owner? I am projecting my voice in hopes that the owner will hear and respond. And the owner is totally on his Samsung Galaxy that he switched from iPhone, which I'm still squirming in my sleep about, but to each his own. Still no answer from the owner. So we will move on. That's searcher was See, I hate that I'm only collecting in game. See, because that would be so. Dude, if I was collecting Ragnarok, mm -hmm. so that's like one of my favorite movies of all time. Much less the MCU. If I would, dude, I, like a part of me wants to just get them, and just just in case I go for like a Ragnarok collection, because the Hulk in Ragnarok, Thor's whole design in Ragnarok, Hela, like all of it is just so so awesome. I mean, he's got quite a few to start out. I think he has a Thor. It's just not entirely loose. I don't know. I'm still thinking about what I'm gonna do, but I, I love my in-game collection so far. I mean, that's looking great with the nice Chris Evans autograph just front and center mm -hmm. in the mm -hmm. display. Yeah. You know, as, 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 as my boy right there. Anyway, so, without further ado, we will do the mug chat. And on start. The mug chat needs to be done. Antarji? Let's go. Let's roll. Stop stealing figures. What? Stop stealing figures. Guys. Everyone. F. This gets, goes at, this is not shade. Everyone gets To a an specific F. individual, though you know who you are, if you are a specific individual. Mm -hmm. But you should really, like, stop stealing. Why do people steal? No reason to do it. <laughs> you have no reason to do it. Leo, there's people, you don't even know what's going on, do you? No, I don't actually. There's YouTubers. <laughs> there's creators that have connections with people no. who take figures out of the Hasbro factory. What? Before it's revealed. Stop! <laughs> so they take the figures out of the factory, like oh. figures that they're like discarding that, they, that they're not gonna sell. They take them and they sell them third, like offhand third to people third. for higher than what it's actually worth for the purpose of getting early like videos. And that's how they grow their channel. That's how they get clout. From stealing. I don't normally like talk about it. I've known about it for a long periodic time. Uh -huh. I just didn't talk about it, but it's getting out of hand. Like, I I don't know, man. It's, it's a little bit ridiculous. It's a little ridiculous. Ridiculous. I would say, because I know a lot of people watch these toy hunts, and it's the one opportunity I have to say, speak up. Um, don't support people like that. Because not only does it absolutely tank the reviewer community like you know other people who are doing it legitimately waiting for it to come out the to right do it way. The right way. you know all the cloud and all the excitement and all the dopamine releases go towards the the, the the thief but not only that but like it ruins Hasbro reveals because we already seen it you know and it it, it totally it is unfair because people other people can't get it early there's just a lot of things wrong with it so and oh yeah and the first thing stealing is wrong so right i just i don't know man i don't i'm not supporting anybody who does that because i just don't by principle i just don't believe it's right and there's a lot what i really hate is the folks that are like um excuse me excuse me it's just a toy it's just plastic if that's what you're upset about then you need to change your life first of all it's not i'm not upset about the plastic it's not like what they're doing it's, it's, the, it's the it's the concept right. the principle of them stealing not the toys. I don't care if it's... It's the fact that they're doing something wrong to get ahead. Yeah. Like, you don't have to do the wrong thing to get ahead. You can do the right thing. And get further. And get... You can even get further. 
just be honest. Like, have morals and have, like, a brain. Right. And I and think the rest of, if the, if If everybody in the world just... If they only had a brain, we'd be fine. We would not be on the brink of collapse. No. no. We're going to Target. <laughs> just have to throw that out there. Yeah, because, you know, figures that we don't steal. Right. That we buy. We buy. That we pay for. Yeah. And we wait until they're out and hunt for them. When they're out, because that's the legitimate way to do it. When they're out. Hey! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Christmas, 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 Christmas. Christmas. What are you getting? Jiminy Cricket. Jiminy Cricket? Yes. Thank you for choosing Starbucks. My name is Ethan. What can I get Starbucks for you today? Well, Merry Christmas. That's the first thing. Can I get a strawberry refresher? Substitute the water for lemonade with a uh, uh, medium. Sorry? With light ice and light berries. Very specific. Do you guys have the uh, pep? <laughs> Do you have Energon? I'm sorry? Do you guys have Energon? No, I do not. You don't have Energon? Okay. I'm super excited because this is my first Christmas coffee from Starbucks. Can we talk about how this mug chat, this mug chat guys, is not going to be food? It's not going to be food. It's going to be a drink mug chat. It's going to be an ASMR sip chat. Ooh. Sip chat. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm excited because, like I said, it's Christmas time. It's Christmas time. And this is, what is this? The peppermint white mocha. I, li I, I like to get my flavored hot coffee, and he went with the cold today. Look, I think, I think lemonade is just good. Lemonade's good. So and he then, got the refresher. Which is a strawberry lemonade. Strawberry basically. lemonade, basically. I'm ready? Just, you ready? First sip. Let's get it. One. Two, three. So good, I could really feel the peppermint. It tastes like caprice in my soul, dude. It tastes like caprice. It like, really does. Like it tastes just like caprice. I those those really do taste like caprice. I know Christmas is two months away. By the way, this is from four weeks ago because I take older questions. Right. Like I said, uh, but what are you most excited for this Christmas? And what Transformers do you want to see next year? Is Studio Series even? Though uh, you don't collect them anymore. Oh, I see. Oh, in studio series. Okay. Um, well, yeah, Christmas time. Very excited. Uh, I know I don't, yeah, I don't collect studio series stuff for, uh, anymore. I'm, I'm sticking with the big boys. But I do want to see, see them continue, do the like the like the Age of Extinction, the last night. I want to see them finish off the Bayverse. I want to see more Bumblebee characters. I know we're going to get those, like the Soundwave and Shockwave. Um, and I also want to see, obviously, Rise of the Beast because we're going to be getting them, uh, you know, figures for the new movie as the new movie comes through. And Studio Series is going to still be well off into their figures. They're not going to be done by the time Rise of the Beast comes out. It's next year. Once they're done with, like, the live-action films that they're doing right now, it would be awesome to see them go into, like, Predacons Rising for Transformers Prime. We need for them to do accurate figures mm -hmm. for Transformers Prime, not legacy, whatever they're doing. I want like it to look like Bulkhead, please. Cause that's what he looks, I'm sorry, I'm right. <laughs> mm -hmm. I took a question and I went to a rampage. Yeah. I'm sorry. I, just... I don't know what I want for Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> question numero dos. Numero dos. This is for the both of you. Well, if you could visit an alternate universe where Transformers actually existed, would you go there or pass? I would humbly pass because I love my life. Because I like to live. And frankly, <laughs> I don't want to be knocked over or mm -hmm. killed by a falling skyscraper that Bumblebee... A falling skyscraper, yes. Someone's knocked down. All right. I feel like I would do it and just hope I don't die because I want to see what it's like. But then, like, you're right. Like, why even take the risk, you know? Because, it, it, I mean, it's there's going to be a war. Yeah. Because there's going to be both sides. Right. So they're going to be fighting. Like, am I ready to deal with that? No. Like, am I willing to risk it all to no. experience it? No, 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 But it's no. cool, Leo. No. Imagine you freaking see Starscream <laughs> flying in an okay. F-22 okay. Raptor, if... and he, f he transforms. Don't tell me you wouldn't think that's cool. In I real would, life. I would think it's beyond fantastic i think the words would not be able to express how much fun i would possibly have but at the same time the thought of me dying 
This is worse. What if Starscream's like, yo, locusts, homeboy? And then he like befriends you. You would be a Decepticon at that point. I would be with Optimus and we would be fighting. Exactly. But still, you would, would I, live. Would I want you would live through it. We are a mess today. We are. Hey. Hey. Big fan of your work. Thanks. Question for you. Whoa. Who would be a figure you'd like to see from either SS or whatever comes after Kingdom? Honestly, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I want more MPMs. That's all I want. I want yeah. more movie masterpieces because that's the higher quality figures. Solid. Bigger scale die cast. More expensive, yes, but worth it. Um, and even if like they release an MPM and it's not the best figure, like Starscream and, or like a Ratchet, there's gonna be KOs that come out. Third parties that are gonna perfect it, make it nicer. And that's what I did. I trans I transitioned my Ratchet to a KO, and I and I did the same for Starscream. I got your reaction for that when you saw Starscream. Sure. I want more MPMs because that engineering is going to transition to third party and that's gonna, that means better figures for a lot of us and more accurate. And it's long overdue. These movies have been out for literally years and we're just now getting to that. Most MPMs are metal, right? Yeah, there's a lot of, there's die cast metal pieces in them. There's some plastic, some alloy, just, it's a mixture. <laughs> well, okay. But they're higher quality than like the over the shelf right, plastic. Right, right. Cinco! Cinco de Mayo! I was thinking. You were? Yeah. You didn't say so it? Well, it's like Great minds think alike. We did not just do that. Oh my god, I hate you. <laughs> In addition to the rumors of the Studio Series Transformers Prime, mm -hmm. when you say that, oh, you activate a little bit of greatness in me. Not the word I heard. That we had, do you think Hasbro will continue as with the SS86 or they will stop it only at those? No, I think that Hasbro is a money-grabbing company. So they literally, they're driven by profit and any little bit of dollar and you think they're gonna keep going? that they can get, they're going to capitalize on that and make sure that they can get that. Really? Um, that's why they milk G1 for literally everything because people buy G1. People don't stop buying G1. They, don't, they literally take G1, G1 and G1. just suck at the teat of G1 constantly. I'm sorry, that was, I Terrible. should not have done the, I should just pick up the phone and like keep that. I was trying to illustrate a cow when you like, anyway. So, <laughs> he was gonna do it again. what was I saying? Yes, the answer is yes. Is that what you were at? She agrees as well. How's that MP and third party collection of yours going? All of this is just about third party. Have you sold off or given any are giving away any of your mainline figures and what do you think about what 22 has in store for us fans rock on i just love the energy in that comment so i just went ahead yeah. and added that comment thank you ruiz yeah, yeah. it's great collection is going great i'm simplifying a lot of things even a lot of the third party things that i had i'm simplifying to like dark of the moon mm -hmm. age of extinction slash last night and i'm done mm -hmm. all the 2007 stuff now if i have figures that can count for like dark of the moon like the mpm ironhide with like the upgrade and I got like Ratchet, I got a Dark Moon version of him. You know, I'll keep them. But a lot of the figures, I'm, I'm, I'm really, I'm really simplifying because I don't have to have it all. That's just where I'm like mentally, I'm evolving to that. Like I don't need to have everything. I can only but have you the. Want to have it. I want to have everything, but I don't need to. So like I'm even with the bigger figures, I'm focusing on what I really love to make a nice, simple display. I love three zeros. I'm gonna get some more of that. And uh, yeah, so it's looking good so far. I have sold a lot, I've sold a lot <laughs> uh, of my mainline figures, but I have kept all of my Optimus Primes. I have not sold a single Optimus Prime. My Prime Shrine is the exact same number as before. And, and what I think about 2022, listen, I think we have a lot of Transformers in store for 2022, honestly. With the live action film coming out, finally, can't wait. All the marketing that's gonna come before that. And then you got the new figures coming in the next year. I think it's going to be a good year for Transformers fans. Honestly, just I just, you know. And Rise of the Beast is going to be a different take. So you think that the people complaining about SS86 are overreacting to G1 being in Studio Series? No, I don't. Um, I think that people have a, have a justified reason to be upset that G1 is in Studio Series. The figures look fantastic. I'm not talking about the quality of the figures. They all look great. They're accurate. To the animation is fantastic. But, you know, Hasbro milks G1 constantly, without fail. I like SS86, the quality of the figures. But the fact that they did that, 
before finishing papers, which is what my initial point was, long before, kinda, kinda makes me do this, you know? Mm -hmm. Makes me itch. But it is what it is. <laughs> People have a right to feel what they feel, you know? Like, I feel like that's not really a lot I mean, you know, let people complain if they want to complain, and it, I mean, as long as it's like a constructive reason, a justified reason, it's okay. If you're complaining just to be a hater, that's different. <laughs> and Optimus Prime is behind this. Thanks for the questions. Great questions, and a lot. Some of these were from a while back. I think all these from a while back. A good bit of them. <laughs> um, so we are gonna go to Target, good old Target, to conclude the hunt. I have a good feeling about what's over there. I hope it's good. I think it is. Without further ado, thanks for your questions, and we will move on with the hunt. Push it. Push it. Push it. I was just going with it, brother. I said target target lot. Target target lot? I said target target Tarjay. Tarjay. You guys say Target or Tarjay? Yeah! I got, I have official confirmation from Target employees that is Tarjay. Let's go. I'm gonna predict a lot of stuff. What are you gonna predict? Few stuff. Few? Oh. All right. Here we go. <laughs> Just a few empty spaces. I don't know if this is a few or a lot. This Here is a not a lot. Oh yeah, uh huh. You're gonna say that, of course. I mean, it's. it's, 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 it's not, New figures on the block don't stop. Merely rock, pop, rock and drop. Oh, I don't know what that was. I'm sorry, people are watching. So I got Studio Series Thrust. If you can't trust, then you must. Then you must get robust. See, that's why I gotta have you here, cause you gotta like be my backup. <laughs> I'll be making up words, dude. Cyclonus, um, looking good. Hey! Rhinox. Rhinox. I don't even think I found Rhinox ever. Let me know in the comments if I ever found this guy. I don't think I've ever find, found Kingdom Rhinox in store. He actually looks great. I mean, I'm not a Kingdom guy. I'm not a Beast Wars guy. So it's not like, ugh, you know? Do, do, do that one more time? People do that. <laughs> people go off. Like that, you know? Yeah. That's me with Optimus. Right. <laughs> Take a look over here. We've got a uh, slug on the plug if you know how to drop a rug. Oh. I actually said that exact sentence in the last hut. So I kind of cheated, but... And now you feel defeated. I mean... Oh! Dropping the bar exam. And over there, you've got Ultra Magnus on the Stagnus. Oh. Now this, I think a lot of people are going to love right here. Look, right here, right here. This is the four-pack... Buzzworthy Bumblebee. This is brand new. Optimus Megatron B and Starscream. The Four Amigos. The Barbershop Quartet. So we already had the four pack for these guys. Kingdom. With Nemesis Primal. And this was really, really popular for a while. Well, now we have the G1 version. I'm pretty sure this is new because I've never seen it before. I haven't seen any of the news that actually confirmed this was coming, but... It's not, it has never been here before, so I'm pretty sure this is brand new. Right over here, we've got uh, Buzzworthy Bumblebee, we've got Origins B, we've got some Core Class here. Um, looking good, we've got a Deluxe Class Blur behind him. We've got a 74 Bumblebee, and we found him at the Toy Room, so that's awesome. My boy, Joe Electrify. Transplant. Oh, watch every movie ever all over again for the rest of your life. <laughs> That's your homework. To watch a movie. Okay, fun. A movie a. that we reference. Just one. That we reference. Darker than Moon. Darker yes. I, I approve. We've also got Check Come Out. Rodimus Prime. Rodimus, Rodimus, Rodimus Prime. That's obviously a play on Shardimus. But it works for Rodimus because it's the same syllables and same thing. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna use it. I'm going to borrow that from you, Shardimus. Don't come for me. No, but I'm liking this. I really like this. Um, Hot Rod was fantastic. Rodimus is even better. Lots of different display presents, like different things you can do with this guy. Really happy to see him. 
Uh, he's a good whopping $85 for those who are willing to pay that. <laughs> and I am not among those people. Also, see, see, Bay Bird is my jam. You know that. You know that. Come on, Jack. This is, this is it. Now, I've already found this guy, Grinder, but it's good to see him still here. Surprisingly, he's still here, and I'm really amazed by that. Uh -huh. You like this? What is it? Grinder! Transformer. Ooh. Have you seen any Transformer movie? Yes. Which one have you seen? I've been wanting this. I've been wanting that one for years. You've been wanting this for years? Yes. Yeah. Well, they had a blackout before. Now they have a grinder. So there you go. Okay. No, it's really cool. He's really cool. Oh, shit. Yeah. How much dollars is it? How much money? It's a good 50 bucks, man. Oh, shit. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone in the from? United States, right there. You know, I say I don't like kids, but I do kind of like kids. They're, just, they're super, the cool ones. Right. The ones that cause problems. We don't sing, we don't sing, we, we don't. <laughs> <laughs> Marvel right Legends. Marvel Legends. Hey, the Hydra Stumper. Have you seen What If? Dude, please tell me you watched something. What If? What is What If? What if I didn't watch it? What if I didn't watch it? What if you would do better? How's that? This is from the What If show. This is with Captain Peggy Carter. And Steve Rogers actually occupies this suit. So that That's kind of big. He's, he's actually inside of that. Yeah, and he's he did, they did a good job as a team. So, actually, the Hydra Stumper Marble Legends. And he's huge. There you go. I wish you could, like, there was an extra head with, like, Steve Rogers' little head in there. I just... You All are right. obsessed. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Dude, look, 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 look at that. Zoom into that. Zoom into that. Come on. I have a justifiable cause. Marvel Legends, check them out. Um, lots of Eternals. 99% Eternals. 1% <laughs> Loki series. Mobius and the Flobius. In the middle of the Strobius. So there you go. Got a lot of them. Eternals, by the way, has officially entered theaters. Go check them out. I haven't seen it. Are you going to watch it? I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> I'm really surprised that had, there's been no MPM Optimus Prime for the uh, Bumblebee movie. Normally, you would see those show up in stores, but it doesn't look like it. But that's pretty much it. You can give them another wide and uh, kind of show them off. And uh, I don't know if you showed off the Y for them, but you can do that if you'd like. Give them a glance. Lots of great stuff. Great improvements, especially uh, as we enter the holiday season. There's going to be a lot more. There's new waves of things coming through, especially for Marvel Legends and Transformers. So it's exciting, but we just got to wait. Basically. Got to wait. After Thanksgiving, I think it's going to really ramp up. And then after Christmas, it's going to completely die off like it does every year. Black Friday is going to come through. <laughs> it's like that weird time of the year with stock is just dynamic, you know? There's another end cap here. Give it a look. Ooh. Well, a little few Marvel oh, Legends. My God. It is an onslaught of Richard Mack. <laughs> I can't. I can't stay in the store. I'm going to lose it. I'm going to. Um, I'm going to. Uh. What is this? Crow. We have a crow. Great this stuff. is definitely new. This is something for Eternals. Usually when they get overstocked like that, they leak over into the end caps, and that's exactly what we're starting to see. That's the end cap. It's nice, I wish though. We had an end cap for Transformers, and they had B-Movie Prime Masterpiece. Still waiting on him. Mm -hmm. I could get him online easily, but I like to, you know, give it some time, let it fluctuate, and get him in store. Anyways, guys, that's pretty much it for this toy hunt. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We got a lot of stuff. We saw a lot of things. Love what they had here. This is probably my favorite find. I'm just hoping that more new things come through. And that's what we got to wait on. So thanks for watching. This is your Teletrend Toy Hunter. We'll do another one another time. This is your boy, Alfonso. This is your boy, Leo. And we will catch you in the next video. Roll out.